Caulfield Cup. What a win. He's won it by seven lengths. It's a stunning victory. It's been all might and power. Ringy ding ding. It was time to sing. The field is ready to go for the Caulfield Cup of 1997. Jack Denham said to me, he said, have you got a ride in the Caulfield Cup? I said, no, I haven't. He said, you have now, you're riding might and power and hung up. My thought was lead at all costs. Jack Denham said to me that whatever you do, don't lead. I wasn't scared of Jack, I was probably the only one that wasn't. I backed myself. Field is ready to go for the Caulfield Cup of 1997. Might and power and seven, nodding his head. Settle down, big boy. All in readiness. Set to go in the cup. And they're off. He was a little bit slow to begin, and I had to give him a bit of a squeeze to get going. And Deira Bay, ridden for speed, has gone up on the outside to head might and power. I don't know what Jack and Nick were thinking, but at this stage, I don't think they were that happy. Past the 1600, where Jimmy Cassidy had taken might and power to the lead. I just had to be patient, because I'd pretty much gone against instructions, so I had to be right. I was probably going to get my head chopped off and get the sack by Jack Denham. Might and Power trying to lead all the way in the Caulfield Cup takes the field to the 1,000 metre mark, a length in front of Dave Rebate. I sort of had a little, little look to the right. There was nothing sort of coming up to challenge. And we got to the 800, turning, pressure's on. I started to let him slide just a touch. I could hear them there, like uh, they were only sort of three quarters of length off me as we go past the 800. The shadow of the 600 metre marker, believe it or not, he actually jumped it. There we are, he just jumped that crossing then. Might and Power still has the lead, coming to the turn at the 500, a length in front of Deira Bay. Boy, was he travelling. I had a lap full of horse and I didn't hesitate to push the button early. And as you can see, they're all starting to chase behind as we turn for home. But gee, once I let him go, he just opened up. Around the turn now, and Might and Power shot about two and a half in front. Now he puts three on him. Might and Power well clear at the 200 metre mark. Puts four on him. Pump goes to the sticks. It looks all over. Marvel Hall's Give him a couple, he puts five on them. Doremus coming home, but Might and Power has gapped them in the Caulfield Cup. What a win, he's won it by seven lengths. Oh, that was a win, and he's still running. I was thinking Melbourne Cup pretty much when I went over the line. He made them look second rate. It's been all might and power. Magnificent performance from might and power, and even a better one from the pump for lead. And the time is a record. This is one of the all-time great Caulfield Cup wins. Jack looked me in the eye and he said, I thought I told you not to lead. Even the chief steward, Mr Des Gleeson, had a little chuckle when I got on the scales. <laughs> yeah, that was some day. The great might and power.